Finally. If only we could have flown with the wit. <laughs> Didn't we? About damn time. Took long enough. Oh, but that's... Right. I can't wait. Head on over to the plaza. What's going on? It seems busier here than before. Hey, look! Isn't that Bayfon over there? Ah, there you are. It seems I owe you all an apology. I'm guessing you didn't find the Lord back in the forest, did you? No, but something tells me you already knew that. That I did. Turns out I bit down on some bad intel when I should have known better. Apparently, Deadeye's not as trusting of me as I thought. But why would he feed you bad intel? My guess? He wanted me to lead you all astray. Make sure you weren't sniffing around where he didn't want you to be. While you were off in the forest, I got word that one of our squads captured the Lord. The place wasn't even close to where you were searching. I see. Well, the important thing is that you finally caught her. Did you suffer many casualties? You're not going to believe this, but she didn't even put up a fight. She had no escort either. Well, what about her Master Corps? Was it recovered? Sorry. They only briefed me on the basics. For now, Deadeye's getting ready to make his victory speech out in the plaza. In the meantime, I've been ordered to set up a defense perimeter around the outside of the city. So I'll be out of town for a while. I imagine Deadeye will announce what he intends to do with the Lord during his speech. You'll have to let me know how it goes. Anyway, until next time. A Renan Lord surrendering without a fight? Something doesn't add up here. I'm afraid I can't say I know much of her lordship personally. There's a lot about this that doesn't make sense. The Master Corps is a concern too. Let's stick around like Bayfon suggested and see what happens. We don't leave until we get to the bottom of this. about just what Deadeye has in store for Almadria. For now, let's wait at the inn until he gives his victory speech. Everybody's so excited. They can hardly be blamed when they've apprehended an enemy leader. That said... Yeah. Isn't there some way to calm them down? These must be the Danans the Darkwings freed. Yeah. The city might be in ruins, but the people have risen from the ashes. This is the place Bayfon said Deadeim would reveal the Lord's fate. I wonder what he'll do to her. Lord Almadria Kynaris. Please stop! No good can come of such hatred! 
Stop or there'll be no turning back. <laughs> Is this supposed to be justice? I did warn you, did I not? Nothing good can ever come of such nasty hatred. <laughs> What do we have here? Could it really be the witch from Dana? <laughs> Honestly, I thought I had wiped all of you out of existence back then. I guess there was one survivor after all. Mm. Hey, Rinwell! Shut up! This is the only thing that's keeping me going anymore! Stay out of my way or I'll kill you! Rinwell! I'll kill you. I swear it. I will kill you! Sure, you know. But 
when I look into your eyes, I can't let you do it. What about you? Are you not the one who got revenge for his father? Don't I deserve that as much as you? Move aside. If you don't, then I'll blast you again. Even so... Sorry. I'm afraid that I can't let you do that. No way. I can't let you kill her. Not while your face is full of the same hatred as those people who died. <laughs> you saw what she did. What are you saying? She should just get away with it all? You're right. Rinwell, I don't know what I'm doing. But still, I know it's wrong. If you go through with this, I know you'll regret it. I'm sorry. I am. Forgive me. I can't believe you. You, of all people! Of all the people! show quite finished. Why, you... For many years of my life, I devoted myself to the study of astral arts. But the knowledge I took from your family was truly enlightening indeed. For that you deserve a reward. I shall allow you to taste one of the fruits of my labor. Demon Eye 
Is everyone all right? Yeah. But I'll major it got away. Linwell, are you... What... What the hell happened here? Bayfon, is that you? Thank goodness you're okay. I've been outside the city this whole time. But I sensed a disturbance in the wind and decided to turn back. What happened here? Where is everybody? Almadria's handiwork. She allowed herself to be captured so she could rile up the Danans into a frenzy and rob them of their astral energy. She wiped out almost everyone in the plaza, including Deadheim. Deadheim's dead. Everyone. And the Darkwings. Almost all of our companions in the Resistance. How could this happen? Regardless of what she had to gain, what kind of person would do something like that? If she managed to find kinship in Kelzalik, then I'd say the very worst kind. It's clear now that she used Menencia as a testing ground for the fruits of Helgen, before using them here. So everything that led up to this moment was all a part of her plan. Once she knew they'd eaten enough tainted food, she just needed to get herself caught. We have to go after her. Balseth and Ganabel were horrible, but Almadria makes them look like saints. I doubt she's really gone back into hiding. We have to put an end to this once and for all. Yeah, what she's done can't be forgiven. I... I don't know what to do. I saw what hatred did to those people, but... Hating her is the only thing that's kept me going. I can't just stop hating her. What am I supposed to do? Tell me. Smile at her from across the battlefield? Apologize while we fight her? I don't know if I can do that. Rinwell. Nobody can understand what you've been through. We can't even begin to imagine the pain you've experienced. But if hate is what has kept you going ever since that day, then let it be your strength. However, think about this. When you've had your revenge, when we've beaten Almadria, then what will you do? Huh? I'm saying you're going to have to find a way to survive once that hatred is gone. When it is, what do you plan on doing then? I don't... I don't know. I've never thought about it before. Almadria's death doesn't have to be your end too. You need a reason to live, Rinwell, not an excuse to die. Understand? <laughs> She's right. We could never truly know the pain that Almadria has caused you. But I think you should listen to Xion. Give yourself time to consider things. And if it's too much right now, it's okay for you to sit this one out. No. My head might be a mess right now. But I'm not letting you fight Almadria without me. I need to be there. Please. That much I do know. I'm going with you. And on the road, I'll... I'll think about it. A reason to live. Without hate. That said... It'll be no good chasing after her blind, with no idea where she went. Bayfon, do you have any ideas where she might have gone? I can't say for sure, but west of here is an underground harbor along a cliff near the coast. 
She spent years building a ship there, a floating fortress that she called her castle on the sea. No one quite knew why she wanted the thing, but now... Of course, she's already effectively destroyed her own capital. It's likely she planned to abandon her realm as well. Right. That's as good a lead as any. Let's go. Nothing good, I'll bet. We'll stop it this time. <laughs> I still can't believe what that Almadria did. Not only that, but she was enjoying it. It's patently clear she has no respect for human life whatsoever. We need to take her out. I don't think I've ever felt so enraged at another person in my whole life. Yeah! There's no way she's getting away with this! Then we head for the underground docks. We need to hurry. Rinwell, can you keep moving? Yeah. My family and I, we spent all of our days just living in hiding. Until... Until one day when we were found and attacked. I was the only one my dad and the others hid. That's the reason I survived. While the rest of my family was butchered. The only thing that I could see was the crest of a lord glowing through the smoke. And then... And then... It was Almadria who did it. Oh. I'm sorry, Rinwell. That woman... Did she really find the existence of Dan and Mages to be that much of a threat? Enough to invade another lord's territory? No, I doubt that. Most likely, she was after their knowledge and techniques. She only did it so she could become stronger. That's the kind of woman she is. In retrospect, I do remember her making it sound like she created that monster she summoned. A monster? I wonder, do you all think of me as a monster? Because I'm able to use magic even though I'm Danon? Rinwell. Of course we don't think you're a monster, you dummy. Huh? I might have had to hold you back, but it's her fault any of this ever happened, not yours. Got it? Ah, oh, 